lot of friends I had at the uh, neighbors or Rastine Goodson. He was a friend of mine. We grew up together, and he got in trouble and and uh, went to prison. Another guy named Rex Ellis. He got in trouble. I kind of drifted in with him. Was around him for a while. Saw their good qualities. Focus on that, but when they start doing other things, I kind of drifted away from them. And they would always come around the house, come on, let's go do this, go do that, and I go things with them. But I would drift away from them. They look around, I was gone. I, I I can't explain why that I always backed away from trouble, from bad things, from unpleasant things, uh, and they were there. But I just kind of went away from it and and went on and dealt with the good side of people. It, it sounds, from what you said about your parents, that they gave you a pretty strong foundation as far as what was right and what was wrong and what was expected of you in terms of doing the right thing. Mm -hmm. I mean, they there was did. a strong sense of, of values there. Mm -hmm. um, and I have a brother like that now. He just quiet and go about his business, does his thing, and you know, it's like it's like living in the world alone. I mean, there's all the people around, you know, that crowds, neighbors, people all everywhere, and just in your own life and understanding who you are. And I, I missed that. I lost it for a while. Then I wanted to go to Bali and one time. I said, I want to go to Bali to be with the monks and things, uh, to get back into entertaining myself, not looking for things out there to entertain me and make me happy or sad or whatever. Just entertaining myself, reading, studying things being adventurous, going to museums, and, you know, just growing and learning something for me, you know, in my own life. And uh, that's the way I've been. 